Good afternoon from the National Weather Service office in Norman. Here's a severe weather update on our severe weather potential over the next several days. Before we get started, I want to clear up some misconceptions or some misunderstandings about these severe weather outlooks. First of all, please know that these outlooks are not exact, precise forecasts. They are not guarantees that everybody in these risk areas is going to see severe weather or any thunderstorms at all. These risk areas will change as the severe weather days get closer, so you have to monitor for later updates. And unfortunately, the severe weather outlooks are going to be different depending on the website that you're on, the TV station that you're watching, etc. Important to remember, do not let the differences in words, colors, numbers, categories, don't let those confuse you or prevent you from being ready for severe weather. Just know that it's May in Oklahoma and Texas, and we need to just be prepared, pay attention, and be ready to act quickly if severe weather comes near you. For this afternoon and this evening, we do have a marginal risk of severe weather out in far western Oklahoma and western north Texas. We're not expecting a lot of severe weather today, but if it forms, it'll be out, out in uh, the western parts of our area, uh, probably after dark and continuing into the late night hours potentially. Some of these storms could have some small hail and gusty winds. Severe, severe weather potential goes up on Friday evening and Friday night as a storm system gets closer to us. Uh, we do expect a, a higher potential for severe weather on Friday than we have today. There will be some tornado potential with storms on Friday, but still very, still in the very low category and up to quarter to half dollar size hail and some 60 to 70 mile an hour winds. Still some questions about how many storms we'll even see on Friday afternoon and evening. So we'll be watching this closely again. Just because you're in a yellow or green area doesn't mean you'll see a single thunderstorm at all on Friday. It just means conditions are there and you need to pay attention. Saturday has the potential to be the highest severe weather threat of the next few days. However, there's still lots of questions about Saturday. Uh, we do expect a dry line to be over western Oklahoma on Saturday afternoon and a strong upper level storm system approaching about that time. That usually uh, sets the stage for what could be significant severe weather in May over Oklahoma and western North Texas. However, just like we saw last weekend, we could see some showers and thunderstorms earlier in the day. And the longer those clouds and showers and storms hang around during the morning and early afternoon on Saturday, that's that will will hopefully reduce our chances for severe weather later in the day. So again, this is another one that's going to be changing as we get closer. We'll have to, we won't be able to nail this down really well until we see exactly what's going to happen on Saturday morning. So keep paying attention, keep an eye on our webpage, weather.gov slash Norman, and follow us on social media for the updates and all the latest information on the developing severe weather situation over the next few days.